teachers uh, filling out PDFs, even fillable PDFs by the hundred pluses potentially is nobody's idea of fun. So because of that last year, I made a Word doc and Excel pairing that would automate the process of filling in student accredited grades and merge them to form A documents ready to be proofed and signed off on. So um, I've just updated it for this year. So I'm going to go through how it works. So if you shoot me a DM, or send me an email, I will fire you on the zip file. If you unzip the file, you'll find in there two, um, two files, Form A and Student Data. So let's have a look at the Student Data file. So with the Student Data file, we have a number of fields, the student's name, the exam number goes in there, their subject, et cetera, et cetera. Now, there are even more tick boxes this year. Um, I'm not a fan of the design of this form. It's, it's quite awkward, but anyway. Um, but what you'll find is that you're either probably answering yes or no to nearly most of them. So if you don't know how to do a tick mark, just copy and paste it. And if you've already it in one column for like a yes here, you can auto fill it down for all the students. As simple as that. Put in your estimated grades. Then you want to close the Excel file and you want to open the uh, Word doc here. And what you'll find is that once you have the Word doc open, you'll see the merge fields. If you go into mailings and click on preview, you can just flick through it there and check if the data checks out, which it does. And then you can hit finish and merge. And if you hit finish and merge to edit individual documents, it'll give you a Word file with all the students laid out there. Um, or you can send them directly to the printers where it'll print and merge at the same time. Now, I had a few people ask, what if I send this on and it's linked to uh, a location? How do I link to a location on my own computer? How do I change the location of the list? Well, once the list has the same um, headings, you can just link it simply by going to mailings and going to start mail merge, or sorry, edit recipient, no, I'm wrong. Select recipients, uh, use an existing list, point it to the list that you want to use and hit OK. And there you go. It'll, it'll merge uh, a different list if you want um, from the same Word document. So I hope this is helpful and uh, give me a follow on Twitter or if you have any feedback or spot any errors. Once again, uh, it's up to the teacher and the school to verify that the data has gone in properly. Um, so no warranties given, expressed or implied with these files. Thank you.